Okay, hey guys, it's me, Render Eight One. Um, and it is the end of summer. September second today. I start school on the seventh. So I figured, why not do my August favorites? Even though you know I don't really want to, because I mean, like it is, it is like saying goodbye to my summer. My camera is kind of acting funny. Like, it's really weird because, like, this, I have a window back there. So it looks, like, straight white behind me. Like, I've got a background, but I don't. I'm in my living room. But I've got my products set up over here. Um, it was my birthday this month. If you didn't wish me a happy birthday, you don't have to. Um, but, so a lot of these, most of these products I got for my birthday. Other ones I've just kind of picked up and been trying out. So I'm going to get started right away with um, hair. Uh, this is an interesting piece. Um, I just got it, like, last week, I think, but I have been loving it. What it is, is it's a clip, little mini clip-in hair extension piece, and it's purple. It looks blue on camera. It's really, like, this purple, it's, like, a purple with, like, blue. I'll show you guys how I put it in. I'm gonna put it in up here. So I go in a section, and I take it. And like you clip it open, and then you like. My mom did it for me this morning, so I had it in my shower. And then you like clip it, close, and then you like move that hair back over it, and then you can just kind of like work it in. However, you can't. Oh, I want it underneath more. Well, I'll do this. I'll do a video on these. I'm just gonna leave it in right now. Um, these are by Pop. My mom should be bringing me home some tonight some more colors uh but this one's purple and it just came in this little case i haven't really experimented with it too much but i have really liked it next one is my new favorite i have used this i've used these every single day of august literally i've used one of these every single day of august and what they are are these are my eco tool um brushes got them for my birthday and i literally have used one of these brushes every single day of august or since the 11th anyways. So it comes with a fluffy brush, which I love for my bronzer, a concealer brush, a shadow brush, here, sorry, which I like because this is really good for packing on color, and then a liner brush, which I like having a liner brush because this way I can finally, I've actually haven't been using pencil liner lately. I've just been using my liner brush and wet shadows and doing it like that. By the way, I do have kind of an intense eye on. Um, I'm not, it's actually based off one of my pro things in this video, but I'll get to that later. Oh, sorry, totally skipping through. Face products that I've been loving. Uh, the Neutrogena Oil Free Acne Wash. It's the pink one. With pink grapefruit. I said pomegranate before, and I don't know why I got, where I got pomegranate from. It's grapefruit. Um, and I love this. I use this every time I shower. I usually only use it when I shower because I'm really bad about washing my face, which I know is terrible. Don't judge me. Um, and I love this because, like, it's just exfoliating and it just feels really good and it smells delicious. This is a smaller bottle. They have, like, a bigger one and a smaller one. This is a smaller one. So I want to just try it. Then, oh, I'll do this now. Favorite perfume of the month has been... Britney Spears's, I believe this is Britney Spears Believe. It's in like the green bottle. And I don't know how to describe this smell other than it's like a fresh floral. It's kind of floral, but like it's really strong. I love all Britney's perfumes because they are really strong and scented very well. But um, if you guys want more on that, let me know. If you guys want more on any of the products that I'm showing, let me know because I will do. Where is that piece? There. But whatever, if you guys want any more in depth on anything, let me know. Next is my face primer that I've been in love with. I've talked about this before, but I've really kind of been digging into it and like using it. Like, focus. You guys can't really see it, but it's like, I've pretty much hit bottom. But this is the L'Oreal Studio Secrets Magic Perfecting Base. I love this. So I just put it on my hand. 
you guys probably can't tell, but it just like smoothed everything out. And like covered in all my pores. I love this. It is a really small jar, but a little tiny bit of it goes a very long way. Next is my favorite elf products of the month. Um, I'm surprised I don't have any others, but this has been my only one. And this is the e.l.f. Um, Complexion Perfection. This looks like this. And it's got like pastel colors. Like this is a pastel yellow, blue, red, and green. And what this does is it just really kind of helps your, um, your complexion. I really like it. I put this over my foundation, under my stay matte powder, and under everything else. So like I do, I'll do a foundation video, but I do this primer, I do, I do primer, concealer, foundation, this, and then stay matte powder, and then bronzer, and blush, and all that. So that's my little quick overview. And this is just in, there's not even a color name for this, because it's just this. I like it a lot. Um, I Like, I didn't think I would. Like, I just thought it'd be, like, another powder on my face. But it does actually kind of help. Moving on to eyeshadow. Okay, these two have... I've put on my eyes. I'm kind of slowly moving away from them. But I had been putting them on my eyes for, like, a good two weeks every single day. And this is by CoverGirl. This is the first one. And this is by CoverGirl. And this is the Eye Enhancers Trio. And this is in Golden Sunset. These are just like really, I want this light on, but I feel like it'll like white everything out. Yeah, that just makes everything really white as it is, even though it is. So I've got like a really nice inner corner color and such, and then like a middle crease, and then like an outer outer corner slash crease color. I love this. I like, I paired this up with my next, which is Maybelline Eye Studios. Um, it's like a mineral eyeshadow is what it is looks like it's just called mineral eye studio by maybelline new york and this is in bronze blowout and it looks like this okay look at the dent i've made like do you guys see that like it was all round and like now there's just like a big dent right there um really pretty really 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 pigmented the brown like i swatched this once like i just okay what i did once was i went i'll show you i go like this i take one finger run it all the way across and I'll do it on my arm it literally keeps trailing until I get to here like that's how pigmented it is like and it's pigmented like it's pigment like it's really hard to blend out like I I love it it's it's amazing I definitely am in love with this next I gotta keep moving along because I'm already at eight minutes is by Avon and this is the true color quad and this is in vibrant spice if I can get it open I will show you guys but if I can't get it open we might be it looks like this we've got a gold a like a rusted like an orangey kind of color I don't know I don't really like this color um this purple which isn't as vibrant as it should be I feel like it should be more vibrant and then like a brown so it's like a it's like a and then the brown is like a purpley brown it's like a red brown i don't know i kind of like it the shadows aren't as good as like like i want them to be but i mean what can you really expect i think this is like five dollars i've liked it then this is from the love and beauty collection by forever 21 and i love this palette the, okay one major reason why i love it and i always bring it with me is because i don't have like a compact like mirror this is the mirror it's huge like the whole top of this is mirror like this is all mirror and it's a big size mirror like I can see my whole face in it like that and then here's like the colors it's a neutral palette I love it I've definitely dented this color I love this color right here it looks really really white on camera but it's actually kind of like a hold on my fingers are dirty it's like a what finger can I use I don't know all of my fingers are kind of dirty it's just going to show white on camera, but it's not. It's like a, it's got color to it. Then for mascara, I've been loving the L'Oreal Voluminous Million Lashes. And this too. It's really shimmery too. I wish I could use it as like a mirror, but like you can't. But it just looks like this. And the brush looks like this. I love it. 
even though for when I do like touch ups and stuff, I like falsies. But like if I don't want a ton of mascara on, I use this. And then two lip colors, lipsticks that I've been loving that I got for my birthday are Born With It, which is like by Maybelline, which is like a, I, I like to call it a baby pink. Everybody else says it's not. I think it is. It's right there. It, it is very much so. I just put it on my lips. Very much so like a baby pink, I believe. And then the other one is my drugstore nude that I had searched for and searched for. Looks like this. Just a regular nude lipstick. I'll swatch it right here. It's really orangey though. I wish it wasn't quite so orangey. I like pairing the two together. Because then it kind of like pinks it and whatever. But yeah, those are my, I think that's everything. Yeah, those are my August favorites. Those are the products that I've been using pretty much every single day. I want to know you guys' April favorites. Comment. Leave me comments. Um, subscribe. Still working on getting contests together. Um, so, do that. Alright, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye.